All right, here we go. Petrofogger, check. 14 gauge outdoor extension cord, check. Solution, <laughs> bonide mosquito barrier, check. Three of these in here. PPE, double check. This one and the goggles. I'm ready to get at it, so let's see how this goes. So, did I like the fogger? As a first time user, yes, I absolutely did like the fogger. And I know I don't have anything to compare it to, but what I am thinking of here is that it was simple. It was not hard. That goes a long way with me. So if you are in the market for a fogger, I would absolutely recommend this fogger. Now I will say that personally, I prefer cordless equipment. So that was the only drawback for me, was being tethered to something. Um, but I, I had a long enough extension cord and it worked just fine. So I don't even know personally if there are cordless <laughs> foggers out there. I don't really need to know. I like this one, I'm gonna keep this one. I'm gonna use this one. Before I close this out, there's just one thing I wanna touch on and it's personal protective equipment. PPE. I had most of mine on, but I realized in mid spray that I only had on a short sleeve t-shirt. It is very important to have a long sleeve shirt, your mask, your goggles, your gloves to protect you. So you may notice the wardrobe change. I just, you know, went in the house really quickly and took a shower. So hopefully I'm covered. We'll see. Hopefully I don't grow any extra appendages or anything like that. But I wanted to stress that it's very important, especially when you're spraying something like this, chemicals and things, to have that PPE covered. With that said, my friends, I'm going to end this video. Thank you so much for coming by and watching. And I hope it was valuable information to you. And I will catch you in the next video. Until then, keep those lawns healthy and strong.